Today's topic is going to be comparing yourself to others and genetics. One thing I keep encountering is when people keep comparing themselves to others. The problem with this is that everybody is different. We are bio-individuals. We are all made up of different stuff. Almost everything about us is determined by our DNA. Now this plays a crucial role in pretty much everything to do with health and fitness. Now unfortunately, we have no control over our DNA. Now some people are genetically more gifted than others. Now these are things that we can't control. So get over it. Everyone has their limits and their predispositions. So these are all key reasons why you shouldn't compare yourself to anybody else. You have no idea how long somebody else has been training or how hard they've been training. Now social media can have a really negative impact on your body image. We set ourselves unrealistic expectations of what we should look like. We spend ages scrolling through Instagram looking at the next fitness model, when realistically, we're never gonna look like that. Not to mention that half of them are photoshopped or on performance enhancers anyway. Half of them are lying. Oh, natty bro. These people are paid to look the way they are and they don't look like that all year round. Stop comparing yourself to these people. For one, you're probably not genetically as gifted as they are. And two, you don't have as much time or resources on your hands. Now, if these people are positively influencing your life, then great. But if they're making you feel like shit just because you don't look as good as they are, why bother? Stop following them and stop investing your time in making yourself feel like shit. Comparison is the thief of all joy. It's a good one, that. Now here are some of the things you can control. You can train harder. You can eat better. You can be happier. Stay in your lane. Focus on you.